Hello, hello. Welcome back. Game number two against Black Red Dragons. We are going to go on the play. A five lander again, uh, which we must mulligan. Hey, look, the third five lander in three uh, games. We'll mulligan it again on principle. Keep our five here, our five card hand, play a mountain, and pass it back. Um, not a whole lot to say about this start. It's not fortunate. It's unfortunate. There, I said it. I'm not salty. We uh, are playing against Black Red Dragons, which means that ideally our opponent... Well, it's actually a deck very similar to the mid-range version of Red that we're playing. They just gain... Uh, uh, thought sees and some removal that we don't have access to, but we do have, a, you know, like 16 burn spells in the deck. Didn't see Dragon Fodder last game, so that's new to me. Okay, we kept a slow hand, but it's a solid one. Uh, next turn, Outpost Siege is going to be able to kind of reverse or begin to reverse the unfortunate mulligan situation we find ourselves in. And our opponent uh, is on a mid-range plan as well, so, you know, unless he has Rabble Master right now, we aren't going to feel a whole lot of pressure for the next couple turns. So I like our chances here in game two, at least on the... Uh, early game here, the way it's played out is encouraging command our phoenix that's fine we will discard the stoke hate to do it, but we need to keep uh, the dream alive without post siege and we will take two no? yes All right, Siege. Next turn, he could play a Thunderbreak Regent, which would not be very good for us. We didn't show him uh, any one drops game one either, so, well, there you go. Remember what I said about uh, it kind of being a mid-range game plan similar to our own? Well, there you go. In fact, this Black Red Dragons deck would be quite easy uh, to transition this current list, this mono-red mid-range list, into. I don't know how exact they are, but I'm pretty sure they share at least a good part of the 75. Um... We're fortunate here that our siege landed first, so we just get to start generating card advantage um, earlier. But we did mole, so you know we're working with less to begin with. And he has a rabble master he can put on the board, which might just spell our uh, preceding demise. Are we auto yielded? Yeah, we'll just take three here. See what we get. A whole lot of land. Alrighty. Black Red Dragons takes it. <laughs> I'm going to call it here. Uh, you know, this is a, uh, a new metagame in Standard. It's been eh, about five days <laughs> since I played my Standard deck. So, of course, the world is topsy-turvy. Uh, however, that being said... We did what we could, tried to make good mulligan decisions, kind of felt the uh, flood there regardless. Uh, at any rate, it's not going to stop us from playing another one and hopefully winning that one. So join us there, and we'll catch you later.